Welcome back to Senior Pablo TV. Today we will be discussing transforming general form to standard form of the parabola. This is the continuation of our lesson in our videos. Parabola. If you haven't watched the video, please go to our playlist or just click the card so it will direct you in that video. The general form of the parabola is y is equal to ax squared plus bx plus z, while the standard form is quantity x minus h raised to 2 is equal to 4p quantity y minus k. We're going to transform into a standard form. Let's say we have this given x squared plus 10x minus 2y plus 23 is equal to 0. We're going to write into standard form. I'll transform into standard form. So let's begin. Just copy first the given. So x squared plus 10x minus 2y plus 23 is equal to 0. It's just like we're just, we're just solving a, a what do you call this? Rubik's cube or a puzzle. So we need to do, we have the square of a binomial on our left side. So our x, x squared plus 10x, then move other expressions or other terms on the right side to become 2y minus 23. Positive 2y, move the left, that will become positive a negative 2y will become positive 2y, and neg positive 23 will become negative 23. Now, we have a square of a binomial. That means we need to make our left side of the equation a perfect square trinomial. So, x squared plus 10x plus blank is equal to 2y minus 23. We added blank on the left side, we need to add blank on the right side to make our equation balance. Now, what will be the value of the blank? I'm completing the square. In the middle term, 10 divided by 2, so that is 5. 5 squared, 25. So we need to add 25 and 25. Now, this is a perfect square trinomial. So writing the square of a binomial, so the square root of x squared, that is x, copy the sign of the middle term, positive, the square root of 25 is 5, then square. Is equal to, simplify, 2y, negative 23 plus 25, positive 2. So, common factor, Copy x plus 5, square is equal to, common factor is 2, now we have y plus 1. This is now our standard form. Now your turn. I want you to try this problem. Five y squared plus 30y plus 24 is equal to 51. 5y squared plus 30y plus 24 is equal to uh, 24x is equal to 51. Write into standard form. This one. So, in this case, we have y squared. So our y squared must be a perfect square trinomial. So in our standard form, it depends well, uh, on the openings of the parabola. So go to our first video. So if you want to try, Pause the video, then try to answer this problem. Then after answering, resume watching to check your answers. Okay. 
Here's our solution. So 5y squared plus 30y is equal to negative 24x plus 51. So first, divide the equation by 5. So this will become y squared plus 30 divided by 5. 6y is equal to negative 24 over 5, x plus 51 over 5. So that we can make our right side a perfect square trinomial. Now, y squared plus 6y plus blank is equal to negative 24 over 5x plus 51 over 5. We added blank, so we need to add blank on the right side. Now, get the third term. Middle term, 6 divided by 2, that is 3. 3 squared, 9. Added 9 on the left, add 9 on the right side. Okay, this is now a perfect square trinomial. Write into a square of a binomial. That is y plus square root of 9, 3 squared. Is equal to combine negative 24 over 5x. Let's combine. LCD is 5. 5 divided by 5, that is 1, times 51, so 51, plus 5 divided by 1, that is 5, times 9, 45. Now we have y plus 3 squared is equal to negative 24 over 5x, add, so 51 plus 45, that is 96 over 5. And now, get the common factor. So copy y plus 3 raised to 2 is equal to, the common factor is negative 24 over 5. We have now x plus 96 divided by negative 24. Uh, since we have negative here, this will become negative. Because negative times negative will give us positive. 96 divided by 24, that is 4 over, over 1, or simply 4. This is now our standard. That's on how to convert general form to our standard form. Thank you for watching Senior Pablo TV. Now, you're ready to answer your module number two in our pre-calculus.